What's up, plant people? So today I actually went to one of my favorite little plant shops that's local to me and I wasn't sure if I was gonna film but then I got there and I'm like I need to film I need to show you guys how beautiful this place is so I took a little video and I showed you around and um I'm filming the intro the intro the intro now because I didn't know that I was gonna film so okay so this place always has the best succulents and I saw this right off the bat and I've never ever seen this before and it's so cool um they always have the best succulents just look at that string of bananas so healthy and long and awesome so many succulents to choose from lots of string of pearls and they look really really good lots of jade and then there's this um type of crassula i think people call it watch chain it's so cool how like intricate it is and please let me know what type of cactus this is because i have no idea and i have one and i love it look at this freaking ficus so freaking big and lots of cool cacti this one i don't know i thought it was really cool had like two see the two circles it's like two tips almost very luscious ponytail palms and look at this awesome pencil cactus so full and healthy i it was so beautiful i have one though but i would have got it if i didn't always a lot of snake plants yeah da, 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 da. Um, this is a cool um syngonium i love these i think this is a oh, i forget what it's called and these pilea i have to touch everything don't i i literally touch every single thing that i see Oh gosh, they had calla lilies, you know, where am I going? Oh, I love these type of pileas, but every time I have them, they get mealybugs every single time. Well, oh, pilea peperomioides, very, very healthy, if I do say so myself, and I love aloe I love aloe, every type. And I love this too. Like the, I think it's a, I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. I forget the name of it, but it's so cool. It looks like a rock. And this, ugh, these banana plants, the like red variegated ones, they are so pretty. Oh my God, so pretty. And they had some nice little begonias. I think, I don't know what type of begonias these are either. I'm really bad, man. I really don't know. Um, another banana. And look at this. It's like, it's a lipstick plant and it's in bloom, but the leaves were like fuzzy-ish. And this I'm pretty sure is a type of wax ivy maybe. Pilea and the Pilea family, but it actually felt waxy, but it looked like it wasn't. So I thought that was really cool. Always gotta love these big palms. And look, they had a, um, a, a Monstera ansonii, the narrow leaf form. And look at that leaf. I typically like the round leaf form if I were to pick. Very nice Aglionemas. I forget what variety that is called. I do have one, but I, f I forget what it's called. It's not the Silver Bay. Uh, a lot of Dracaenas. Asparagus fern. Which actually isn't a type of fern. It's actually a type of asparagus. Uh, and a beautiful gold, golden Dracaena. Lemon lime, I guess. And ivy no one cares about. Coming around <coughs> down here. We have some beautiful air plants and they display them pretty nicely. I I love air plants so much. 
they are wondrous to this world how they literally drink out of the air are you kidding me look at this one too i've never seen one this one actually has like a little detail like the red striping on it i've never seen one with that type of detail and i thought it was worth a second look i love the log look so nice and these were flowering ones oh pretty pretty it looks like a bird of paradise flower almost um bromeliads yada 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 and yeah okay coming this way huge fiddle leaf fig gorgeous 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 pileas and look at these rubber trees dusty but really healthy and they looked so good the hot pink is so awesome on those some crotons which i hate and really nice dish gardens too very nice little dish gardens look at those <laughs> and going around in circles because i don't know where to go let's go jen um what are these called i forget what they're freaking called they looked so good i almost got one i just didn't want to spend the money to be honest but oh my god they looked really really good a little string of pearls a little cactuses and this jade thing oh my god love it what am i doing with the, oh my what am i doing with the camera gen there's a nice pile of dead leaves okay so here they have like really cute fairy garden stuff and i thought i'd just show some of it like look at that little bench so cute they have like really really freaking cute little fairy garden things and i want to do one so bad and that's that here is the most beautiful huge pencil cactus i have ever seen look at it in all its glory beautiful she is a statement piece and I love these palms too. They're just like incredibly hard to have indoors. And I don't like things that just die. <sighs> Look at that. So beautiful. And look at this for the third freaking time. I love this plant. I can't believe I didn't get it. It is so cool. I think it's a type of jade. I think it is. I think it is. And then I'm looking at these, oh, look at that. Love. Love her. She has character. She has been through it. She has definitely been through it. Look at the string of pearls. So nice. And look at this tiger jaws. I've never seen one so healthy. I don't know. They're hard for me too. They always get mealy bugs or they always like either don't get watered enough or, wait, or rot. Oh, just can't. Here we have beautiful jade, and I'm going over the same spot again, but look at this little um, Hoya heart. Very cute. Okay, here they had some really pretty bonsai, and they're not like your typical bonsai that you'd see. They looked very delicate and really, really nice, to be honest. Lots of palms. Here's their very nice floor that I keep featuring in here. I'm not sure why I keep showing it. For the love of mercy, Jen, pick up the freaking phone. Pick it up, pick it up, pick up the phone. Okay. Here they had really nice little gardens of succulents. Their succulents are always really good. They get a lot of sun in their greenhouse, and th their succulents seem to thrive. Look at them. And then we have all these little cactuses. Very nice. And what is this? I have one at home and I really like it, but I have no idea what it's called. So if you know, I should have looked at the tag. I really did. I really should have. But if you know what it's called, let me know. Look at these little old men. <laughs> so cute. And then here is where my life changed. Look at this. This is a mother of thousands, right? It's not the mother of millions. Or I might have it opposite. But look at these string of pearls. And look at this fuzzy little thing. I think it's a Tritoscantia. I've always wanted one. I'm going to get one one day. But again, look at these Calanchos. Look at that. Come, 
come on. I can't. I can't. And I just, I, I literally can't. I, I had to take a second look, and then I had to go back. And I was going to get that one, but then I saw that one had three, and I was like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So I got it. I did. I got it. Okay, so they have like a really, really nice selection of pots, like all different ones. Look at this for your air plant. Like, come on, could you get any fancier? Could you get any fancier than that? They have every type of pot you can imagine. Those log pots were awesomely cute. These like type of um, painted pots, if that's your vibe. They literally have everything to choose from at this freaking place. It's such a nice little shop, and I like to go there to give them my business, to be honest. I really liked these little pots a lot. They have all the... And then look at these. Look. Looking sharp. Oh. <laughs> ah, I loved that. Oh, look at this one. What's up, sucka? <sighs> that is genius can't touch this literally if you've had that cactus the uh, oh my god you can't i'm a sucker for you <laughs> uh, plant one on me talk dirt to me <laughs> so this is my current situation i have the box here and i have her hanging here so the box will collect all of the babies that fall. There's just no easy way to do this. Um, <laughs> this is her though. Oh my gosh. Hopefully not too many fall. I already saw one fall on my seat somewhere, but uh, whatever. Well, I'll update you when I get home to see how many have fallen off from my 30 minute drive. See ya. Okay, so I just got home and hanging it on the window did not work because it kept banging against the window. So I had to put her down. She did fall over one time. So I feel like, oh, here you could see some of that. But um, for the most part, really not too bad. She did pretty, pretty well. And I'm really happy. I love her. Look at this. Oh my god. Pure freaking beauty. Look at that. I'm gonna go take her inside and I will talk to you guys in there. So I hope you guys liked this video and I hope you guys really like that plant. Like I hope you're happy for me because I'm happy for me. I'm always happy for people when they find like a plant they've really been wanting and like just like a really cool plant to store. So just be happy with me. For me. Okay? And have an awesome day. Enjoy the weather. It's finally nice out. Just enjoy. Life is too short. <laughs>